Hi boys and girls and welcome to your grammar lesson today. So we are still battling through suffixes but today we're looking at ing. So let's have a look at what we're talking about here. A quick recap of what a suffix is. Now before I read this and talk to you about it maybe you could tell your adult what it is because we've done it for a while now. Are you able to? Okay a suffix is a group of letters that can be added on to the end of a root word to slightly change its meaning. And what we're looking at today is ing. We can change some root words by dropping the e before adding the suffix ing. So if the root word ends in e, then we need to drop that before adding the ing. Let's have a look. So I've got the word wave here. Can you give me a wave? Okay, now what have you noticed about the end of this word? It has an e on, okay? Now if I want that to become waving, we know the rule is we need to drop the E to make it WAV. Now, there's no such word as WAV. We're not finished yet, are we? Now, we're able to add our ING to create waving. Well done. If you feel like you need more time, rewind that back, have another go. But if not, let's have a look at some challenges together now. So, here is our first word, chase. I want to turn that word into chasing. But we know that I can't just put ing on the end of it. There's something I have to do. Pause the video and see if you can work it out. Okay, we need to drop the e at the end to create this chass. Then we add our ing to create chasing. Well done. Oh, my, that's my brother Ping. I haven't seen him in ages. <laughs> we are chasing the ice cream fan. <laughs> pretty cute. Okay, let's get back to work here. Our next word is slide. And I want to change that from slide into sliding. Okay, pause the video. What do we need to do? Okay, did you manage to get it? We need to drop the E to create slid. And then we're going to add our ING sliding. Well done. Oh my goodness, this is me on holiday. I'm going to I love the slide. I was sliding. That's my brother. He's not very good at sliding. That was just the cutest thing I've ever seen. Okay, I'm frightened to do the next one. Okay, our new word is smile. Oh, we like this word. Now I want to change it from smile into smiling. Okay, so you know the rule now. See if you can pause the video and you can do it. Okay, we needed to drop the E from the end to create smill. And then, of course, we're going to add our ING, smiling. And this is my best friend, little John. <laughs> He's got a great smile. Needs to brush those teeth, though. I better smile. See you soon. I had no idea that panda bears could smile. My goodness. Okay, boys and girls, your task for today in your packs is to work through this work where it says, do you drop the E to add ING or do you do nothing? If you need any help, give your teachers um, some contact. Uh, you can do that on the mobile or on DB Primary. Good luck and I'll see you later. Hi, boys and girls. I know you've been working very hard. Now, I was listening extra carefully, but I just need a little bit more help. Do you think you could show me again, Mr. Irwin? Oh, thank you. Okay, little bear, you have done the right thing. If you're ever unsure, always tell your grown-up and we can go through it again. So, we have the word save here. And if we wanted to turn that into saving, what we would need to do is drop the F and replace it with I-N-G. Saving. Well done, little bear. Let's have a look at another word now. What if we had the word file? Just here like this, Mr. Bear. And I wanted to change that from file into filing. Boys and girls at home, could you pause the video and see if you can work it out before I tell Mr. Bear the answer? Okay, if you got it right at home, well done. Now, Mr. Bear, watch, we have the word file. We're going to 
drop the E and replace it with ING filing. Do you think that helps, Mr. Bear? Oh, brilliant. I'm so glad. And he did the right thing for asking.